After shootings on campuses like Virginia Tech and Northern Illinois University, colleges are now implementing new ways to notify students of emergencies. Here in Wisconsin, universities have to have ways to communicate with their students, and starting today, UW Oshkosh is taking a step in that direction. Fox 11's Ryan Dietz, live in Oshkosh, and Ryan, what exactly is the campus doing to alert students? Well, UW Oshkosh students found out today they got their first glimpse of how they'll become aware of emergencies on campus, but it wasn't exactly a quiet day. A bulletin board used to be the way to get out a message. Now when UW Oshkosh officials need to reach those on campus about emergencies, they can use speakers and LED signs. This is a test of the emergency broadcast system. This is only a test. The system is designed to alert those on campus about any type of emergency, ranging from a shooting, severe weather, or another reason to evacuate. We think it's uh, one of our top priorities in terms of uh, investments here. And we're, even in these t tight budget times, it's, uh, it's an important thing to do. Students we talked to said they are glad the system is in place. I feel like it would give us more of a warning system. Knowing that they have something, I guess, makes you feel safer. Just as long as there's something in place. And students say it gives their parents some comfort. I'm sure they think about us students quite a bit, so I'm sure it uh, helps them have an easier mind. The speaker and LED scroll alert system is in addition to text message alerts that were started last year. Other forms of notification are a phone hotline, the university website, and campus emails. Son Leitner says the shootings at Virginia Tech and Northern Illinois universities caused the school to implement a system faster. It certainly heightened the, the importance of it, but I believe we would have done some things anyway, such as the text messaging, because we're always looking for ways to notify faculty, staff, students. UW Oshkosh officials say that they will test the system the first Friday of every month, but beyond that, students say they really don't want to hear the system at all. Live in Oshkosh, Ryan Dietz, Fox 11 News.